Hey there, it's me, Red Knight, and welcome back to Hey Day. Now, I'm heading on over to my town because I've got a Derby task to do. Now, my Derby task requires me to pick up specific visitors. And if I can get those visitors, then I can actually complete this task very, very easily. However, I don't actually have all of the visitors in my town, so I've got to go and pick them up. Now, for me, this is the first time to actually start using this multiple pickup option within the actual town. And I'm still trying to get used to it. So I still think there's a little bit more I need to be more comfortable to be using this more effectively. But let's see how it works today. Well, first of all, here I am. OK, I'm in my town. I'm, as usual, servicing my visitors, sending them to the buildings, making sure that I can do the ones I can do, the ones I can't. OK, maybe I'm going to be sending away. But I've got a lot of visitors visitors there. And with the actual sequence there, you can see that I've only got a couple of visitors for my Derby task that are, I'm basically that I'm able to turn around. Some of them are waiting, some of them are being served, some of them are maybe not even in a building yet because maybe the building is full up. So I need to hedge my bets a little bit. I need to actually go and pick up some passengers from my fellow hoodies. So I'm jumping on the train. Now going on over to my first one here, so as we can see all of the visitors are in category order, i.e. person order. So I can click two of the visitors I want. Now clicking on the train again actually opens up the menu one more time, allowing me to then go to another person station. I can then click on the passengers there, I can then again click on the train, come back to uh, my visitors board here, go and see who I need to pick up from another station, and I've got the option now to jump to many platforms. And I like this option. It makes it so much easier for me trying to find a specific number of visitors. Now, be careful. If you actually make the mistake and you hit your train, it will go back to your station. And then you don't have the ability to go and pick up any more passengers, even if your train is not full up. Now, one thing I'm not really sure how to do yet is to cancel this. So I've been to a few stations, I've collected the passengers and they're on the train, but how do I change my mind? How do I actually delete the number of passengers there? I can't quite work this out. Now, is it by pressing the X mark? Do I need to press that X mark, then go back to my station? Uh, does it mean the train is still loaded up? I'm not really 100% sure on this. So as I play around with this a little bit more, maybe I can suss out how to actually cancel the visitors. Do I need to go back to the actual platform and do it? And then maybe once I get to that platform, press on that visitor again. So there's a little bit more I need to tweak with my videos I'm going to be showing you over the next few weeks of me actually picking up passengers because I want to discover what I can do here. Now I've already made one mistake prior to this one before making this video. I actually pressed my train too early and this is why I know that you must make sure you pick up all the passengers first before you actually go back to your station. But the cancelling part I'm not really sure yet. Now if you know how to cancel the visitors that you've added to the train please do tell me. Now, one thing I did notice that once I'd actually collected all of the passengers or chosen my maximum of 10, uh, it did tell me that my train was actually coming back to my station. And I'm not sure what I did wrong there. So is it because it was actually maxed out or is it because I'd actually pressed the button to go back to my station? Like, like I said, I, I need an instruction guide on this a little bit more and I'm going to be working on this as I tweak my knowledge on how to use this option to pick up passengers. Now guys, okay, you probably had more experience than this if you are more active in the derbies for passengers. I've been rather busy, so I'm not 100% sure on this side. Please do comment below the video. Give me your advice on how to use this option a little bit better. If you know how to cancel, please tell me. If you know how to delete passengers and maybe add in another passenger instead, please tell me. If you know uh, how to actually stop going back to a or back to my station before I've even picked up all of my passengers, again, please tell me. If it can't be done, let me know that as well. Uh, but you've got the option now to communicate with me. And then please 
please give me that information so I can then make another video or a few more videos actually passing this information on to everybody else because it's a feature that I do like and it is rather useful as you can see these visitors are now arriving at my platform here so a lot of strong men or Mr. Muscles are now getting off which means I can now actually send them to the buildings get my derby task done much more effectively now one thing I like about the town task at the moment is the fact that I'm getting a lot of extra reputation points and a lot of uh, XP as well. So these actual town events during a derby, fantastic. I love them and they are absolutely perfect. Right, now that's me red signing off. You've got a basic idea on what I've been experiencing here. Uh, maybe you've experienced the same kind of thing, you have the same kind of questions. Let me know. Now, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you do leave comments below. Uh, please, I do want them in this case. Uh, also, as well, hit that thumbs up mark if you liked it. Hit the thumbs down again if you're not too keen on it. If you would like to follow me, you would like to subscribe to my channel, again, hit that little subscription button up in the top hand corner. Make sure you click the notification bell as well. Now, as you can see here, this is my postal address here in Japan. If you would like to actually send me some fan mail, please do so. Did you know that I'm actually drawing postcards and sending them to everybody that now sends me a letter as well? So if you would like a hand-drawn Heyday postcard, uh, just send me a letter in the post and you will get one in return, if you give me your return address, of course. But either way, see you next time. Have fun, happy farming, and comment below. Goodbye now.